Carry on for the Southern Rome. I, I, I find its best expressions come as the vines get a little bit older. It takes on a little bit more minerality character to it. Uh, it's nice and light and bodied, uh, very, very food friendly as well. Um, you, I'm thinking of a lot of roasted vegetables, I think, go along very, very nicely with Carignan. Uh, as of recently, I've seen a lot of uh, Carignan being added to different styles of Priorat, uh, which is uh, another wine that I typically very, very enjoy. Uh, a producer uh, who I believe uh, you guys have had just recently, uh, Vayak, I think does an absolutely outstanding job and blends uh, Carignan very, very well into the Priorat alongside the Grenache. Typically, Carignan is found in a blend. However, uh, occasionally you'll be able to find uh, some single varietal Carignans. Um, regrettably, around Austin, you won't find too much. However, uh, uh, nationwide, you can typically find pretty good examples of Carignan for about uh, $20 or so. Uh, and again, nice, easy drinking, food friendly wines, about medium bodied, uh, embodied a little bit of smokiness, a little bit of minerality to it, uh, a, a little bit of, uh, of the, the darker fruit varietal, but just absolutely fantastic, fantastic food driven wines. I think you could easily do any type of pork uh, with, a, with a slightly darker sauce to it. Uh, I think it, it met, goes very, very well with uh, an herbaceousness. Uh, I, I think of uh, Herbe de Provence is something that goes very, very nicely with it. Uh, just anything with a nice uh, herbaceous uh, mineral character to the wine would really make the wine stand out.